With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello friends, question is, when a dice is thrown, list the outcomes of an event of getting A, a prime number, B, not a prime number, then in second, A, a number greater than 5, then B, a number not greater than 5. So we have to find the possibilities of the event. So here in this question we have to find the number of outcomes from these conditions. So as we know when a dice is thrown then the possible number of outcomes are they are either 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, right? So, total how many? They are 6, right? So, we have total number of outcomes as 6 when a dice is thrown. So, if we see first one, A part, a prime number. So, firstly, in first part, A, when a prime number. Then, number of outcomes number of outcomes of getting prime number will be that is 3 sorry 2 3 or 5 so we have total how many that is 3 outcomes So, if we see the formula of probability is probability equals to number of outcomes of prime number by total number of outcomes. So, by that we know number of outcomes of prime number is how much that is 3 and total number of outcomes is 6. So, that will be 1 by 2. Now, if we see B part. So, in the question it says a number, sorry, not a prime number. So, when not a a prime number. In that case, number of outcome of not getting prime number. Is that is one 4, 6, so that is how many? That is 3. So, we have total outcomes as 3. So, now if we put again the value in the formula of probability, that is number of outcomes of not getting prime number is 3 by total number of outcomes is 6. So, we will have here again 1 by 2. Then if we see case number 3, that is second part case 1. So a number greater than 5. In that case, second part A. So greater than 5. When greater than 5. In that case, number of outcomes. when greater than 5 so, so 5 out of 6 we have only one outcome so by the formula 1 by total outcome is 6 so we have 1 by 6 as our answer for this one so now let's see case number 
B part. In that part, it says a number not greater than 5. So, when a number not greater than 5, then number of outcomes will be outcome 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 itself. Right, because the question says when a number not greater than 5. So, what is greater than 5? That is only 6. So, we have number of outcomes as 5. So, by the formula, number of outcomes not greater than 5, we have 5 and to total number of outcomes is 6. So, we have 5 by 6 for this one. So, we have answer for this question is 5 by 6. Then for A part, 1 by 6. Then 1 by 2 and again we have here 1 by 2 in the first part. So these are the answer for this question. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.